uh, besides yourself and, and uh, Hank, um, can you think of any other prominent person as opposed to denomination who uh, also rejects uh, John Darby theology? I think Ernest Angley rejects uh, John Darby theology. Do you happen to have any knowledge on that? I, I do not know uh, about that. But there are, uh, you know, there's going to be there's going to be a lot of reformed people out there that don't. Uh, for example, R.C. Sproul, though he's now died, uh, he didn't he didn't accept Darby's theology. Uh, D. James Kennedy didn't accept it. And of course, he's he's gone now too. But uh, I would say any reformed teachers out there are not going to be Darbyite. Uh, now there are there are reformed Baptists like John Piper, uh, who I think he's premillennial, but not Darbyite. I think he's I think he's historic premillennial, as I recall. His of course his specialty is not eschatology, but other things. But uh, yeah, I I can't really say. I mean, there certainly there are. There, I do hear teachers from time to time on the radio and in, in books that are not Darbyite, but it is it is a dominant view in most of the Christian media. There's no question about that. As far as denominations go, um, not only the Catholic and the Eastern Orthodox and the Reformed churches are not Darbyite, but uh, the Church of God, Anderson, Indiana, the Church of Christ, and some other of the smaller groups like that that don't call themselves denominations, although they really are, uh, they also... Uh, they also are not Darbyite. Uh, 